So congratulations on your retirement. You guys both worked very hard to get where you guys are at now. Uh, we're very proud of you. Um, I came out here to Bella Clina just to film the video today. Uh, I don't usually play golf here, so I just came out, thought it'd be a good view. But congratulations, can't wait to come visit you guys out there. Um, yeah, very excited for you guys, congrats. Congratulations, Shelly and Dennis, on your retirement. We're so excited for you. We will never forget the time that we all went into the channel during the monsoon and got locked in our mid cabin. We ate chips and salsa and drank margaritas and Steve-O had to go out <laughs> the, underneath the door to let us out because we were stuck. We love you, have a great retirement. Happy retirement. We're so excited for you, yay! Congratulations, you made another milestone. Hope you have a good time. Make sure you get plenty of rest, because that's all you're going to get now. And uh, hope to see you soon. Love you guys. Love you both. Congratulations. Uh. <laughs> hey, Dennis, Shelly, hey, happy retirement and being able to get out of California and be out with us in Arizona. You guys have a great retirement. Enjoy your time. Congratulations. Congratulations on your retirement. We look forward to seeing you in your new home. Love, Love you. Love you. Happy retirement, Shelly and Dennis. You guys made it, you know. Uh, we love you guys so much. We're excited for the next chapter. <laughs> <laughs> Can't wait to visit you and stay at your new house, and, <laughs> and you can cook for us, and I can. we can go. We can go on hikes. You know, uh, it's gonna be a great. Woo! Woo! Yay! Retirement. Okay. In all seriousness, we love you guys so much. I'm looking forward to hearing about all of your new adventures and the wonderful new friends that you guys are going to make in your next chapter of retirement. Yeah, and we can't wait to visit you in your new dream house out in the desert out there where it's all nice and warm and, and friendly and away from all this nine to five hustle and bustle shit, you know? So congratulations on retirement, guys. Love you. Love you. Hi, Shelly. Hi, Dennis. It's Becky and Frank. <laughs> hey, we just want to say we're so happy for both of you and... At least you don't have to work so hard anymore. You could enjoy life and the river and just fun times. And we're super excited. We're so happy that we've been friends for so long. I've been very fortunate to have met Shelly. She has been a big inspiration in my life with arts and crafts. And she knows this. And uh, I love her very much for that. Thank you, Shelly, so much. And I'm going to pass this over to my husband. <laughs> Well, Dennis, me and you have known each other for some time now, and uh, you've been a really good friend, and I couldn't ask for anything better. Uh, Shelly, I'm glad that you and Becky are getting along and doing things almost like sis like sisters. Mm -hmm. So we've been through some good and bad times, but uh, can't wait to hang out with you guys when we get to retire. But congratulations on the retirement, <laughs> and uh, looking forward to seeing you guys soon. We love you. Yep, love you guys. Bye. Hey Uncle Dennis, hi Aunt Shells. Congratulations on your retirement. We're super excited for you guys and can't wait to hear what it has in store for you. We love you guys so much and are so happy that you guys get to experience this new adventure. And just wanted to th say thank you for all the pool parties and barbecues. And Dennis, thank you so much for teaching me every single word to Palmdale Afro Man. I'll never forget it. Um, and then those five o'clock beers at the shop. I'm gonna miss them. We love you guys so, so much and hope that you guys enjoy your party and have so much fun. Love you. Bye. High five. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Hi, Shelly. <laughs> I'm so happy for you. I'm happy for retirement. I'm happy you're moving to Arizona. And I'm so excited for you and Dennis as you step forward into this new adventure. Um, I had such a good time getting back together with you uh, last year, and I hope that that's just the beginning and that we uh, are able to share each other's next chapters together. Love you. Hey, Miss Kinsey. So I can literally hear you teaching right now in the other room, and I am hoping to God that you do not walk in right now, but I'm selfishly gonna just be so sad when you leave because I've really found a friend in you and I'm gonna miss you so much and so are all of us. Thank you for your service as a kindergarten teacher and have a fun 
new adventure in retirement. Gonna miss you so much. I love you. Hi, Dennis and Shelly. Hi. Um, well, uh, congratulations on your retirement and your big move. That's uh, so great and we're so happy for you. And um, we're excited that you're leaving Lancaster and that- um, Oh my God, yeah. <laughs> yeah. We've um, liked life a lot since we left Lancaster, that's for sure. But um, have a great time. We wish you many, many, many years of happiness. Um, we go back a long way. I think I've known you, Dennis, for two thirds of your life. I was trying to do, <laughs> trying to do the math, but um, I can remember uh, when you were pretty young. And then um, I'm trying to share some memories. I know I thought this was very interesting. When Roger and I bought Lancaster Transmission, um, the fr we closed escrow and the next day we got ready to go in and I had taken the day off from my job and we were gonna have our first day as owners and you called in sick. <laughs> and we're like, oh man, but it was for a good reason because uh, that's when Jennifer was born that day. Oh my. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> and then we saw more babies come and then when Shelly came, we uh, she brought two wonderful girls. Oh, you forgot to say what, the, you, what his nickname was. Oh yeah. They used to call Dennis the kid. <laughs> That's how young he was. But um, anyway, it's been a long time. We've been through uh, good times, bad times, long, long times of working together and um, long times of just camping and being friends. And, and Shelly came. I mean, that was like the beginning of when I got involved. Yeah, <laughs> we got Shelly and we got Ali. Yeah. And uh, <laughs> Everything's been good ever since, and we think you're just gonna love your life, and we hope that you have um, the best time ever. So stay in touch, and uh, have fun. Hey Dennis, hey Shelly, congratulations on your retirement, and we look forward to coming to see you soon in Arizona. I know you spent a lot of time here working hard, and I know that this is going to be a much deserved uh, relaxation and um, enjoyment of your retirement because the best years are yet to come and we're excited to come and visit you not in the hot 120 degree weather but in the nice cooler weather and uh bask in the sun like kitty cats so we're very excited for you we look forward to sharing your adventures um and thank you for being in our lives here in the illustrious antelope valley and uh, we look forward to seeing you in the illustrious arizona please don't leave us here alone Hey guys, happy retirement. As you can see, I'm sitting on my boat, but the boat's in the garage. Anyway, retirement is quite a ride. Hope you have fun with it. Sally used to always say, why do you guys hang out in the garage? Well, my garage is my happy place. I got all my toys in here and it makes me happy. So happy retirement to you. It's five o'clock. I got to head to the strip bar and throw some money at some girls that I don't even have a shot at. Enjoy retirement. Man, Dennis, can't believe you're finally done. You've been coming to this place for fuck, what? 30, 40 years? Man, I've known you for a long time, but didn't think this day would ever come. Hope you guys enjoy your retirement. I had fun working here. You've become a great friend. Uh, a lot of good times here. A lot of uh, crazy times on this street. And uh, I hope you guys get to sit back, enjoy your retirement, drink a lot of beer with your buddies, hang out, fish. You and Shelly, go get to do what you wanna do. Guess what? Don't lay around and rust up now, you know, cause, uh, you know what happens, you hang out, sit on the couch too long, you get rusty. That's probably why you guys aren't moving to the beach and went to the desert, you know, so you don't you don't rust up. So, but hey man, it's a good good uh, good working with you. You guys have a, a great life. I'm sure we'll see you guys over that way and uh, keep in touch. Hi Shelly. 
I wanted to send you this message to let you know how much I am going to miss you next year. Oh my gosh, when I think back at all of the lives that you've touched and all of the adults and children that you've made a difference for, it really overwhelms me with joy and happiness. But at the same time, I'm really sad that I'm going to be without you and the children are going to be without you next year. So good luck to you in retirement. I'm so happy for you and Dennis. This is a new chapter. I look forward to getting to my own retirement chapter one day. But just know that you are going to be missed next year. And as happy as I am for you, I am also sad because you will leave a big hole here that I don't think we'll ever be able to fill. All right, Shelly. Love you. Hi, we got asked to do this video because we heard you're retiring. And I feel sorry for you because nobody wants to do that. Nobody, I mean, there, I, we all know there's a time when we have to, but... Nobody likes it, you know. Just, yeah. We heard you got a brand new house and yeah. in a yeah. sunny place. That's awful. Nobody likes that. Sorry, I'll send you some big card. And uh, we'll be able to get up and go fix broken transmissions or mm -hmm. deal with screaming, screaming kids. Screaming kids all the and time. I don't know. What, it doesn't sound like fun. No. So no. I'm so sorry this has no. happened to you. Mm -mm. I am too. <laughs> I can't wait to do it. <laughs> yeah, we're so happy for you guys. We love you so much. Congratulations, Shelly and Dennis. Have a great retirement. Yes. So just, Where do you start? Here. Lancaster Trans. Yeah, and that kind of Seventeen years there. We did a lot of baseball. Lining up that wide line. Then we built a lot of cars. This was Dennis's DD car. One of them. That's him in the driver's seat testing it out. Then we move over to the next year one. Yep, he ran a wagon with a wing on the back. Lin and Ali. Mentored a lot of kids there in how to do clean up a shop and it just grew over the years. It was a place, you know, we worked side by side for 17 years. Congratulations on your retirement. I'll be joining you in a few years here. I got to go to 2025. Congratulations, you two. Stay in touch. Hi, Dennis and Shelly. Uh, congratulations on your retirement. Uh, it's quite an accomplishment with uh, all the things that you've done in the past with uh, particularly Shelly redirecting her career and turning it into what it is and Dennis uh, uh, making Lancaster Transmission what it was with Lynn and then uh, turning it into his own legacy when he took it over. So it's quite an accomplishment. Congratulations. Uh, thinking back of all the all the fun times we had and everything, the one thing that sticks in my head is is Dennis was always the king of nicknames, um, and it, for some reason he always come up with these fitting nicknames like uh, pork chop or, or uh, hack master or uh, or who can forget weed man, and there was always Mahon head gasket and uh, and Black Bob and and who knows how others that I can't mention and the others that I've forgotten, but. Um, everyone seemed to know uh, who you were talking about when you referred to that person by their nickname. Um, but when you spoke to the person directly, you didn't use the nickname. So it, make, it makes me wonder whether those, person, those people really knew their nickname. And it, then it made me think about mine. Did I did I have a nickname? Um, <laughs> so, um, and I don't know it if it was. So now that you're retired, maybe you'll take a minute to give me a call and, and let me know what my nickname was and how you came about it. So, uh, in closing, we just want to tell you that we love you and we're happy for you and congratulations. Enjoy enjoy your retirement. Congratulations. All right. Bye. Hey, Dad and Shelly. Uh, glad you guys got to retire and go up to Bullhead City where you guys be big chilling. Go do what you want. I'm sure you got to have a lot of days off up there. Uh, looking forward to kind of seeing you guys and congrats on your retirement. 
Hey Dennis and Shelly, you guys have probably heard a bunch of beautiful comments about your retirement from all your friends and family, but I thought I would give you guys some ideas on what you can do during your retirement. One thing you can do is come sit at the park with all your free time, cause you ain't got shit to do. Go for walks at 4 a.m. at the mall for exercise. They have malls in Bullhead City, right? And now that you guys are retired, you guys can spend every day, week, month of every year with each other. Oh, that's gonna be great. However, that just sounds like another full-time job. So maybe you're not retired yet. So they say that retirement, it's not the end of your life. It's more like mm, the end of your money and it just somehow just goes away. <laughs> But remember though, money in retirement, it really isn't everything at all. It's totally overrated. However though. It smells like marshmallows. <laughs> money will keep you in touch with your kids. Bye bye, tax. <laughs> Woo, and have sex. Yeah, you remember what that is, don't you? Oh, but never ever have it in your guest bedrooms at your new house. Don't do it there, ever. And make sure you use protection. That's really important. Use protection, especially blood pressure and heart medication. You're gonna need that a lot. You're definitely gonna need that. And when you have sex, don't tell anyone. Nobody, nobody wants to know. Especially never tell. Your kids. They don't wanna know. They nope. don't care. They don't care. Nobody cares. Nobody cares. The funny thing is, I just put the image of you guys completely <laughs> naked in everyone's heads that's watching this, and I'm gonna end the video with that. And on that note, I love you both, and I hope you enjoy retirement. You both definitely deserve it, and we look forward to visiting. Yep, happy retirement. Bye-bye. No clothes on. <laughs> Naked. This cat is really pissing me off, too. She just wants attention. Do you have to poop? What's your deal? You.